we're going to create a purchase order in Cispro. You can find the shortcut in your favorites, or you can go to the pro program description list and find it under purchase orders and purchase order entry. You need to enter a supplier. If you do not know the code, you can always hit magnifying glass and search for one. I'll be selecting Century Security Fasteners. Purchase order date is always today. The due date, I just usually select a few weeks out. So we can select uh, December 2nd. You need to put in your buyer initials. I'll put MCS. And that is all we need to do for that purchase order header section. You can enter either a stock code or a non-stock code. Uh, we'll be entering a non-stock. I have a quote here from the supplier. So this is the item we're buying. And copy and paste the description. quantity order I'm gonna match what I got a quote for uh, 50 hundred that would be 5,000 ordering 5,000 screws the price will base off what they quoted it's 1664 per the hundred so it's 16 cents 64 price when using a non-stock item you need to charge it to a job or a GL code we will charge it to shop supplies consumable and we just hit save click OK this is just saying that it's not allocated to that GL code and if you want to change that just hit no so up here purchase order totals you can see the value is 832 which matches our quote So we're good to put in purchase order and print the document. And now we can email that document back to the supplier to get 